Wade and Wade reacts. We got some demo gameplay footage for Phantom Blade Zero. <clears throat> okay, man, some stealth combat. Oh, put out the bone. That's cold. And that's crazy. Because it kind of moves like a fighting game. Where your opponent does his moves, you, you do yours. And if you catch them in the middle of the move, you can reverse. And he's blocking their attacks at the same time. Kind of similar to God of War, not the pace, but the little health bar. Yeah. So I, got that little, I don't know if it's the white or the yellow. You break it up, you break your defense. Yeah, that move was, this game about to be crazy. Did he do that flip over there because the dude pressed triangle, or can you make the character do that kind of? Uh, it looks like he was in control of it. <laughs> Something about this game, it reminds me of a little bit of Ninja Gaiden, mm -hmm. but also the path of Neo, the freedom that he has to go back and forth between two separate opponents. Yeah. And can reverse just like that. Yeah, what is that, that orange bar at the bottom of the other one? Me too. Like, is that the defense meter? Oh, that's cold. <laughs> that was tight. Hey, this game right here is so free. The combat is so loose and smooth. Okay, they have different weapons too. Okay, I like that. That sword is getting right here. So, I, yeah, I, that is a good question. What the heck is that orange meter? Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. Is that a stamina? It looks like when you break the orange meter, the opponent is affected by its attack. So that's nice, whatever that is. It's cold. I want to see that pole arm, though, because I want to see that. You know, they, they do uh -huh. I want to see that. Oh, hit him with a clean spinning back kick. The finisher. Trying. Oh, dang, did he not do it? He oh. Not do it. oh, okay, I would like to see some limbs coming off. Me too, that, that was crispy, though. I want to see what this move set is like. Well, it's time for battle. So the, what? Oh, so it looks like you acquired a weapon from the boss because yeah. he got that giant sword. I wonder what that move set is going to be. That's cold. You see how he started the battle, though? Yeah, it's the pillar. I want to yeah. some more stuff like that, though. This, this does remind you of the older games that you got in Devil May Cry, those type yeah. of hack and slash type of games. Uh-huh. But it's so much more fluid. And you have defensive capabilities as well. Yeah. So kind of uh, shadows that twice a little bit, too. Yeah, kind of. With the defensive capabilities mixed in with the fast pace hack and yeah. slash. Yeah. He putting in work on this enemy. This must be an upgraded character. That was way too good. I was playing on easy mode. Yeah, it was. I don't know when the official release date for Phantom Blade Zero is, but whenever this game comes out, they got my money. Mm -hmm. I'm definitely buying this game. Hopefully it's not one of those games that has a lot of promise, but doesn't really deliver on the promise. But from what I can see as far as the action and the fluidity of the movements, the freedom in the gameplay, this is definitely something I'm interested in as a hacker, slasher type of guy. Yeah, this and Wukong are the only two games I wanted to play for real. Out of the new gen games that they announced, so that's all I gotta say, I'm getting this game. <laughs> <laughs> that does it for our reaction to Phantom Blade Zero, GamesCon demo gameplay. Don't forget to leave your thoughts in the comment section. Also, like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. 
so that you'll never miss a video from Wade and Wade React. No right there. Peace.